Welcome back to my channel and I'm going to go ahead and get right involved, okay? We don't want to make these videos too, too long because you know I will. So what I'm going to be doing today is a quick weave. Now, after you guys saw the accident I had with the Gorilla Snot, my hair is in major, major and dire need of help. Um, this is where it broke off at here all around my head i have these strands hanging so i was like i'm just gonna quick weave it and let it stay for maybe like two weeks and see if i can get it growing back but if not the beginning of january i'm just gonna cut my hair to here i'm just gonna cut it all off i mean you're gonna have to i'm gonna have to cut it down to get it even to get it to grow back it is after I perm, I said I never perm my hair, but I have because I just couldn't manage it. Um, the ends here were uneven. My hair actually was down to here, but it was all sporadic. So I was like, you know what, let me just cut it up to here. But I see that I'm going to end up having to cut it up to here. There's nothing. It'll grow back. So what we're going to be doing is I'm going to go ahead and um, quick weave my hair. I have already... What, uh, what I did was I rinsed the product out of my hair with hot water as hot as I could stand it. After I did that, I blow dried, I uh, permed, and deep conditioned my hair. Because like I said, it, it is, y'all, I just don't know how bad I want to cry right now because of my hair. I had grew my hair all the way down. I mean, I had some good length. And then to have it ripped out like that was just kind of devastating. But... Um, that's neither here nor there. Andre, turn that heat off. So, I'm going to go ahead and quick weave it. But, I will say that this gel right here, this is a clear ice, the one I showed y'all last time. Now, I when I said in that video that I'm going to get my hair growing back and I'm going to use what I was used to, I was used talking about Ampro gel. Now, the Ampro gel that I used to use was the clear yellow gel. I never used the clear, so I did not know, you know, but I just thought Ampro Pro Style Gel was just a good brand. This clear gel, it does not hold. It says flexible hold, though. So I guess, you know, you could brush it out coming out. But it does flake. It flakes a lot. So don't let this fool you. This is the gel. I want you to see it very clearly. And it is Ampro Pro Style Clear Ice Ultra Hold Protein Styling Gel. This flakes a lot. I had so much buildup cake up, caked up in my head. When I was washing it, it took me like 10, 15 minutes to get that stuff out, okay? So, I primed my hair, deep conditioned it. I used a, I'm trying to find my products. I used an olive oil um, perm, and it was a normal. In the perm, you got um, some oil sheen. So, I was happy about that. I always could use oil sheen, so I'm glad for that. And after I permed it and dried it or whatever, I put some of this on it. But today, I went to my local beauty supply store and I did get purchased some stuff so I did get me some different gel just to try to see you know how this will work I've never used this type of gel so I don't know anything about it I'm just showing you what I'm trying as of now so um, after I parted my hair and blow dried I slicked my hair back into a ponytail with this okay and this is the Eco Style Professional Style and Gel Super Protein. My hair needs some protein and a lot of help, by the way. This is a max hold of 10, as you see right there. And it says that um, pure Eco Style free of formal the hide, paraben, sulfates, alcohol, vegan, safe, cruelty-free, safe for daily use, non-toxic, made with love in the USA. We'll see how much you love my hair. Okay, so I purchased this at my local beauty supply store for $2.99. I also got me this because this was what I was talking about. Remember I said I was looking for pink oil moisturizer, could not find it in my size, and lo and behold, they got this big one there for $10.49 plus tax, y'all. You can't beat that. Look how big this is. I'm going to be using this forever. And all you only need like a palm full, you know, to distribute it through your hair. I also found me some edging control. I never used this before. This is, I think, from Cream of Nature. It says, yep, Cream of Nature, coconut milk, 24-hour edge tamer for natural hair. It says it smooths, holds, and controls edges. Now, like I said, I do not know anything about this. 
I have never used it. I purchased this for $3.99. Okay. Oh, it smells good, but as you can see, they don't feel that joker to the top. That's the top. It's all the way down there. They know they can cheat people out of their money. And then instead of to pump it up gold, because that's such a strong hold, and I don't want to put no more stress on my hair, I got me a pump it up, the, just a regular formula. This one was also $3.99. And I got me, they have wig caps, uh, what I have one here, for a dollar, for two. So I got me five of these. So I can keep my hair quickly because I'm going to tell you, my hair needs time to heal. So what I'm going to be using today is going to be Shake and Go by Shake and Go. It's the Organics Master Mix. And it's a special color. This was $21.99. It says that you get 20% more hair. One pack does it all guaranteed. I got the body wave because I'm feeling like, you know, I want to ride a wave. You know what I'm saying? So as you can see here, this is the 14, 16, 18 inch. It is curling iron safe up to 400 degrees. And the color is OT27, just in case you're looking and you like. Okay. Now, I'm going to go ahead and get started. Since I already have my hair molded, I'm going to show y'all the, the purpose of this video. Y'all have seen plenty of people do quick weaves, right? So, I want to show you how much these bundles um, are given. You know, we want to see what uh, each bundle can do. So... I'm going to go ahead and shoot it. They making sure you ain't still in here nowadays, honey. They making sure they taping this joker shut. Oh, the tape, Lord God. They say y'all going to be stealing no more beauty supply here. Y'all girls need to cut it out, too. Y'all making it bad for all of us. People, Everybody don't want to steal. And y'all making it hard for the people who's out here living, getting that queen the right way and doing what they got to do to get that hair. You see what I'm saying? So these bundles are pretty thick. This is the 18, this is the 16, this is a 14. So this is the weft. Hopefully you guys can see that. There we go. That's the thickness of the weft. Now it looks big, but I think that weft is just uh the weft is just thick. It's on a thick weft. So what I'm gonna be doing, oh it's synthetic, y'all. Look at the hair. Oh, it's got static. Oh, in this joint. So I'm going to go ahead and put this hair in. I'm going to install the 18 inch. I'm going to show you how far it goes. Then I'm going to install the 16, 14, and we're just going to do it like that, okay? So I'm going to go ahead and get this installed. And then I'll come back to you and show you how far I made it with just one of these. Just in case you're interested in this hair, you're going to know if you if one pack really does do it all. Because that's what I'm here to show you. We're going to put it to the test and we're going to see how far this goes. All right? Okay. I'll be back. Stay tuned now. Okay, girl, guys. I mean... This is some beautiful hair. I thought that the person at the um, beauty supply store was going to deceive. You know, I thought it was going to be stiff. Nobody, no movement. My hair flows right. My hands flow right through the hair. Okay. And this is the end of the 18 inch. Let me show you where I'm ending that in the back. Okay. Check her out. Movement flowing. Okay. She's stopping right here. This is half of my head. So we're going to see what we can get with the 16 inch, how far we're going up. I don't even know if we're going to get to use that 14, but we will see. Okay. And I'm going to go for as natural as I can. So I don't want to jam pack it on and make it super duper thick where it looks like a wig. All right. I'll be right back. Stay tuned. Okay. I'm back. This is with the 16 inch. This is where we are. I like the bounce of this hair, the movement of this hair. It is flowy. It moves with me. Um, I like the color. Um, let's throw it to the back. And I'm going to show you guys where we are so far. Okay, here we are. And it's looking full. Let me sit down a little bit. It's looking full. It feels full. It doesn't feel heavy, but I'm at the top of my head now. So, there we go. Here it is. Pull it back to the front. It moves 
just the way I like it. So now, as you can see, this is what I have left. I'm going to go ahead and do that 14 inch and then I'll come back to you guys for my final thoughts with this hair. Okay, welcome to Tina Turner. Okay, so this hair is big. This hair is poofy. I'm at the top. This is the 14 inch. You see, I got right to where my hair has been parted, okay? Because I want it to look natural. And the closer you get to that line, the more natural it'll be when you silk your hair and lay it out, okay? That's number one. So, this is what I have left of the 14 inch. And I'll do it like this so you can see. That's about an arm's length, okay? That's a, that's a good amount. So, when the... Um, when the worker at the beauty supply store told me, oh, you're going to have more than enough, she was right. I was just looking at her skeptical because I've never um, used this. And sometimes the bundles look big, but it's just that the wefts are big. So now, what am I going to do with this hair to get this poof out and to get these strands to line up? I think I have some foam, um, some hair wrap foam. And so what I'm going to do is get some foam, put it in, and section my hair off like so. Put them in twist. Okay. I'm going to twist it up. Twist, 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 twist. And then I'm going to put a rubber band on the end just to hold it in that um, twist. Okay. So that's how I'm going to get this curl pattern really popping because I've tried. I do not like sleeping with, um, I do have some curl farmers. I don't like sleeping with them. So it hurts in my head. It's just uncomfortable. And as you can see, I'm steady rubbing my hands through this hair. I'm not getting any strands. I did cut the, the wealth. I did not go the, um, the route where you fold, fold, fold. I did not do that with this hair. I cut the wefts. It is very full, but I think once I um, wrap it up, you know, put my silk scarf on, lay it down for the night, and um, like I said, to put some twist in it to get that. It's got a bend. I mean, it's a body wave, but I want it to be just a little bit more, okay? So this is the end result. This is how it's looking. Um... I can put it behind my ear because of the way I lay my tracks. I can move my hair back. My hair can blow in the wind because of how I lay my tracks. I can blow, my hair can blow in the wind. This is, I just put these on, so they're probably going to be a little loose, but yeah. The hair can blow in the wind. Um, Let me turn around and show you where it's falling. Okay. I can... Throw it to the back. This is what she's giving. This is where she's at, you know. And then once I get tired of wearing it like this, I am going to go ahead and silk it out. You can put heat to this up to 400 degrees. And yeah, that's it. So this is what I have, just so you can be clear. Get a good look at it, girls, guys. All those who are watching, that's it right there. I just wanted you to see. All right, and so guys, what I'm going to do is go ahead and blend this top part in. Oh, ouch. Oh, I got that junk in tight. I'm going to blend my hair into this hair, and I will be back. But you know what? I can do that part on camera because I didn't show y'all none of this. It just takes so long to do it, and I know Okay. if I would do all so, that. I will be right back. I got to get my curling irons heated up. And then I'm going to silk this out on camera for you guys. Okay? Stay tuned. Okay, now I have my... Look, I look like a for real rooster, y'all. So I have my curling irons plugged up and warmed up. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and section off this hair. You know? Look at that. Oh. Lord, God, look at them straight. I should just cut that right now. I'm cutting it. I'm sick of this. I don't care. It'll grow back. I can't be looking like no plucked chicken, y'all. I know somebody probably screeched when I did that. I don't care, girl. It's here. 
Get a girl back. Ooh, I'd rather it be healthy than trying to keep some length if that ain't doing nothing. I'm going to cut this part too. And so, y'all like my um comb? This is my first time ever having a rat tail comb. Let me tell you. I knew that I needed one all these years. Why wouldn't I buy one? Y'all, your guess as good as mine. Okay, so I'm just making sure that I'm getting that. I like my parts to the point. You see what I'm saying? I don't have time for the foolery of no part looking odd. This going to be, oh, this is still looking raggedy. Hold on. We ain't going to talk about raggedy parts. Not here. Not now. Not ever. Okay. I hate trying to do stuff in this phone. It's a glare and all kinds of stuff. So I'm cut this too. Sure is. Get a girl back, y'all. Oh, Lord, please help me. I'm so sad. Lord God. Look at that. That's like three inches of hair I had to cut. All because of some stupid freaking gorilla snot. Oh, Lord, I'm mad. I'll never use that stuff again. Just to ruin my whole freaking head. I was going to do a video showing y'all um, how my hair looked after I permed it. Ooh. But I was too sad. I was almost in tears looking at combing through my head. And I said, Lord, help it grow back, God. Give it the strength. Oh, let me get it right now. Cut it right there. Oh, y'all. Come on now. He said, I ain't going. Yes, you are. Y'all, look. That's a lot of hair cut. This is how long my hair was. Hold it at the top. Look at that. Look at that. That's how much my hair was ripped up. Freaking gorilla snot. Oh, I swear I never. I ain't ever got to worry about me again. Okay. So, when you're blending. Oh, Lord, just to see that shortness. Y'all, I'm fighting tears right now, for real. Y'all think it's a joke, and it ain't. I'm so serious. So, now that I got my few strands uh, silked out. I'm just going to brush, blend, brush, and blend, okay? Mm -mm -mm. Oh, look at that. You can see it. Oh, it's so short. Oh, my God. Mm. Oh. Mm -mm -mm. Y'all, please be careful with these products. Don't just be putting any and everything on your head. You never know. What it could do to your hair. Everything is not for everybody. Just let me be y'all's. Just let me be a lesson to y'all. I don't want. Every, I don't want to hear of nobody talking about their hair didn't feel out like mine did. My hair was literally ripped out, and I'm talking about. I lost at least three inches of hair. At least. Okay, so I got this kind of blended in. And then what I'm going to do, let me hurry up because I'm, I'm really starting to get upset, y'all. I need to hurry up and get up out this camera today. It ain't even no joke. So I'm going to take this layer. Now, this is just something I like to do. You don't have to do this. But to make it blend better with my hair, I'm going to hit it with the flat irons. And the hair together okay so now you can see a difference you can see it's smooth you know it's smooth right with your hair let me look to the side yeah now that kind of causes it to be um seamless and of course my hair is not the same color as this black is because it 
was bleached and is transitioning from black to brown or blonde, you know, whatever the color is. And so, of course, it's different. But this is the hair, y'all. Lord have mercy. My strands, Jesus. Woo! You talking about somebody mad. Lord God. Help me, Lord. All right. So, yes. Honey, come through. Look at that scalp. Look at that part. You know? Tracks where? Tracks where? If I wasn't really bald-headed, you wouldn't know that this wasn't growing out of my own scalp. You know? <laughs> And I know, it's hard to believe, but this is what she's giving. <laughs> giving a little Jessica Rabbit right here. Now her hair was swerved over her face. Give you a little Jessica Rabbit, you know, not much. <laughs> giving you something. Look at the wave, look at the bounce. Let's see how she turns, okay? Okay, I can deal with that. I, I, I can take that, you know. <laughs> If I want to put it in a ponytail, what we going to do? You know, let's see what we're going to do. Let's see what we got. I can comb it behind the ear. Some people don't know how to put tracks in their hair where it look natural, where you can pull it behind the ear because they bulk it up on their head so thick. And once they get finished with all that thickness, look, you can still see my ear on both sides honey and that's a natural looking ponytail okay in glory in all her glory she's giving you everything you need boom here you have it here you have it here's what i'm saying ponytail galore if i want to give you know some little bit of sassiness with it I want to feel like letting her bounce, let her flow, let her hang. This is what she's looking like, y'all. I'm so glad that y'all watched this video on tonight. This is going to be the end, you know, because I do got to get up and go to work in the morning. So what we're going to do, yep, I got my leggings all the way up to my stomach because it hurts. And my incisions are throbbing. That's neither here nor there. So, Yeah. Would I recommend this hair? Most definitely. Look what I got. Look what it's giving me. Okay, let me just step back. It's giving me, you know, blonde bombshell. You know what I'm saying? Bomb, just call me bombshell Barbie, okay? This is what she's giving you. Bombshell Barbie. You heard it here first. Don't forget it, okay? And don't use my name. This is what it is. If you like this hair or you have any questions about this hair, make sure you give me a comment in the comment section down below. Um, if you want me to come back and give some reviews after I've worn it, maybe. Because it's staying in for two weeks. I don't have time for no games. I don't have time to be combing no hair. I don't, I'd be so tired, I don't feel like it. So now that I have my hair done... I'm going to try to make it go for two weeks, okay? I'm going to see what I can do, all right? But if you have any questions, comments, or concerns about this here hair, honey, and all the life that it's given me, remember, hit me up in the comment section. And um, I will respond. I respond to all. Um, there's no discriminating. You know, I don't have any faith. Well, <laughs> I can't say that. If I do, you know, it's a secret. But... Thank you guys for watching. This video has been long enough. And yeah, I'll be back soon to show you how she responded and how she acted in life. Okay?